Ladies and gentlemen, the MMA Kingdom, King JB is back. Uh, today we ain't going to be the MMA Kingdom, we're going to be the NBA Kingdom. Because ladies and gentlemen, one of my favorite times of the year has come. It is the NBA playoffs. I'm excited as it could be. Um, I'm a diehard Chicago Bulls fan. I do like the Miami Heat, of course, because I'm a big LeBron fan. Of course, you know. But at the end of the day, I'm, I'm just a huge basketball fan. Uh, I want to give a thumbs down to Mr. Jason London, who is not a basketball fan. He, uh, he prefers hockey, so Jason London, you're an ass. But anyway, when we get into the first round today, I'm going to go ahead and give you my predictions. I'm going to give you my predictions all the way into the championship because I probably won't even do another NBA video. But that's just the way it's got to go. Big shout out to Natural Ice, who is my sponsor for the day. And even if they ain't a sponsor, I don't give a fuck. Bottom line is, it's what today is about. NBA playoffs. If you're a man, if you're not watching basketball today, you, sh you should be ashamed of yourself. You're not really a man. That's just the truth. Basketball, football, baseball, those are men's sports. Hockey, I'll give it that. I'm not a big hockey guy, but still, man, you know, bottom line of it is, we got some MMA tonight, the Invita, whatever the fuck it's called, the all-chick league, all-chick card tonight. But anyway, we're going to go ahead and move on, man, as we go. Big shout-out to MMAMadhouse.com. Love y'all, man. Make sure y'all go check them out. Um, in the East, my boys, the Bulls, against Philly. Um, here, here's the thing. Philly's a surprisingly good team. I, I always thought Philly had the potential to be good. I mean, we're talking about Elton Brand. We're talking about Andre Iguodala. We're talking about just a solid team. Underrated guys like J. Rue Holiday. Uh, I think Philly is a scary team. They're actually a team that I didn't want to play, really. I would have rather have played Orlando or New York. Uh, but Philly's a scary team. With that being said, though, I, I do think the Bulls win this. Derrick Rose... He seen, I hope he still has injury problems because we're going to need him to take all, us all the way to the Eastern Conference Finals and hopefully further. Uh, but the Bulls are, are deep all around. They're a better team probably than anybody in the league. Uh, the Bulls right now are just top-notch, man. You know what I mean? Um, they're as good as I've ever seen them, other than maybe the top-notch MJ days. I got the Bulls winning this series. I don't know if it'll go 4-0, but I don't think it'll be – a seven-game series. I think the Bulls will at least win it 4-0, 4-1, 4-2. Uh, Boston and Atlanta uh, will play the winner of that series. Uh, Boston, I know they're old. A lot of people say they're old, but let me tell you something, man. That th those guys are, are still amazing. Doc Rivers is a great coach. Atlanta is always that asshole team you don't want to play because of Josh Smith, Joe Johnson. Uh, I think Boston's going to win this series. I'd be surprised if Atlanta won this series, but i got to say this. This is what Atlanta needs to do to go further. Atlanta needs to get over this hump. They have to beat an elite team. They have to beat the Celtics for them to, to go further. If not, I think it's time to go ahead and break that squad up. Uh, this is a team, Atlanta is a team that should be playing better. Boston is Boston. You know what I'm saying? They're just always going to be Boston. Uh, I, I, I never, ever, you know, feel comfortable going against Ray Allen, Kevin Garnett, Ray John Rondo, and Paul Pierce. I never. Big ups to Paul Pierce. Uh, the Pacers, surprisingly, the number three seed play Orlando without Dwight Howard, who's out for the playoffs. Indiana's going to win this series, probably 4 1, 4 2. I'm not a big Pacer fan. I know all you farmers back in Indiana, you guys are having a field day because your Pacers are finally good again. But let me tell you this the Pacers themselves. Um, they're solid on the defensive end. They're solid, solid team. Uh, I don't think they have it in them to go further. They need one more key ingredient being a shooting guard. Uh, I understand Paul George is okay. Roy Hibbert, he's doing great. The Pacers, I have no problem with them. You know, you guys need it there in Indiana because your coach suck. Uh, assholes get rid of paid man. What the fuck is wrong with you farmers? Y'all are growing some bad tomatoes in that motherfucker. But anyway, moving on. Big ups to Indiana. They are going to win that series. Uh, I'm sure everybody is going to be having all the corn and, and, and tomatoes, and everybody's going to be so happy and just sitting around. What, what do Indiana people do? Chanting, NASCAR, NASCAR. Stupid fucks, this is the NBA. This is basketball. What the fuck you chanting NASCAR for?
But anyway, we all know that's what's going to happen. Now, Miami, New York, the most impressive series of the first round because we don't know what New York's going to bring. New York has an elite potential. Uh, but with that being said, we're talking about the Miami Heat. Miami is just elite, period. Uh, I think Miami's going to destroy the Knicks. I hope the Knicks get better. I'd like to see them do some shit. But with that being said, we got Chicago, Boston, Indiana, Miami. Let's take it a little further. We're going to go to the West, San Antonio and Utah. The Spurs are the best team in the Western Conference. They are. People say they're too old, this and that. Greg Popovich is the best coach in the NBA. Come on, man. Spurs are going to destroy Utah 4-0. Uh, big ups to Utah, though. I do like Al Jefferson. I like I like what they're starting to do there. Memphis Clippers, the absolute best matchup of the entire first round, but definitely the best conference matchup in the West. Uh, this was very hard for me to pick. Chris Paul, Blake Griffin, it's hard for me to pick against, so I went with the Clippers. Uh, but Memphis, let me tell you something. Zach Randolph, Rudy Gay, them, they are beasts. Zach Randolph from... Uh, Marion, Indiana, big ups to Zach Randolph. Uh, definitely a, a huge, huge uh, power forward that can get it done. Very underrated. Lakers and Denver. Denver, man, they are just – George Carl is, is is definitely an amazing coach. No matter who they – they traded away Carmelo Anthony, and the Nuggets are still better than the Knicks. I'm serious. They're better than the Knicks. But Kobe is not fucking around. He gave up the scoring title. He sat out, gave up the scoring title for this matchup. So he would be rested for the playoffs. Lakers, easily. Go move on. Thunder, Oklahoma City against the defending champs. Everybody assumes Oklahoma City is just going to run right through them. Durant, Westbrook, amazing team. But Dallas, man, defending champs, they're still deep. With that being said, the Thunder's going to run right through them. I got Oklahoma City, man, winning this series probably 4-2, 4-3, maybe seven games. But Oklahoma City's running through. I do not think Oklahoma City is the best team in the West, though, uh, unlike a lot of you guys. But I do think it's going to be a very hard series in Dallas. A lot of good first-round matchups. Now, so we got the Spurs, Clippers, Lakers, and Thunder, two L.A. teams in the second round. Now we're going to go ahead and move on up, Chicago and Boston. Chicago ain't fucking around. Their youth will outrun Boston. And I do believe the Bulls will win this series with, with Boston. It'll be a seven-game series, though. It'll be close. Bulls 4-3. Hell of a series. Hell of a series. Derrick Rose, Raging Rondo. Woo! I got the Bulls. Moving on to the Eastern Conference Finals. To play Miami. Because I think Miami's going to destroy the Pacers. I l listen. Pacers are doing well, but not elite well. They're not on Miami's level. Granger's all right, but I don't think his defense really can stop LeBron. Who's going to stop Wade? Give me one shooting guard on the Pacers roster that's going to stop Wade. And I'm sorry, Tyler Hansborough or David West is not going to stop Chris Bosh. Period. Heat move on, play the Bulls in the Eastern Conference Finals. Out West... Spurs are going to destroy the Clippers. Clippers are great. They're young. They can run. I know the Spurs are old, but the Spurs are so talented. Still best coach in the league, Greg Popovich. This team doesn't play around, especially in the playoffs. Uh, they got embarrassed last year. They're not fucking around. Lakers Thunder, exciting matchup. Kobe goes down to Dur Dur Durant to show. Not only did can Durant win the scoring time, he'll win in the playoffs. Oklahoma City does move on, but this is it for them. Spurs, Oklahoma City in the Western Conference Finals. All of you guys say Oklahoma City. I don't give a fuck how great Duran is. The Spurs team is elite. San Antonio will win this series. They are the best team in the West all around. Period. San Antonio, Tim Duncan, Tim Duncan, uh, Manu Ginobili, Tony Parker, who's having an MVP type year. You got who else you got over there? Steven Jackson. The Spurs are going back to the finals, baby. And they're gonna play I hate to say this. Miami. They're gonna beat my Bulls. That saddens me. But they're gonna beat my Bulls. Period. 
Miami's going to beat the Bulls probably in a seven-game series. Derrick Rose, will probably, I think his, his lagging injuries throughout the season will affect him. I got Miami going ahead and winning that game, seven-game series. So we got Miami and the Spurs in the NBA Finals. Miami goes down again. Sorry, Heat. Spurs are not fucking around. San Antonio Spurs, four games of three. Once again, the Heat come this close to winning the finals. But Tim Duncan takes home another one and then retires. Manu Ginobili takes home another. Tony Parker takes home another. Most importantly, Greg Popovich takes home another. They're too good. They're not a superstar-based team. They're like the New England Patriots of the NBA. San Antonio Spurs, four games of three. Your NBA champions. Mark my words. Anybody want to gamble? Let's motherfucking gamble. I'm out of here. King JB, the MMA Kingdom. Dot com. MMA Affiliates Radio. Today is beer and basketball. I'm out.